This is BMAT 2021, section 1, question 24. So, in this question, we have a clock which loses time at a steady rate. At 10.30 on Monday, the clock shows the time at 9.53, and at 8.30 on Tuesday, the clock shows 7.42. And we have to work out what time will the clock show um, on half past four on Friday. So, where should we start with this question? We know this clock is losing time at a steady rate. So if we find out what this rate would be, we should be able to work out um, what the time is going to be um, at 4.30 on Friday. So how will we do this? Well, let's compare the time of slowing difference between our two times there. We can work out a rate. So on Monday at 10.30, it shows 9.53. This means that it's 37 minutes slow. If we do the same on Tuesday, we can see that this time the clock is 48 minutes slow. So what's the rate of slowing? Well, in 22 hours, which is the difference between um, these two times, we can see it's slowed a total of 11 minutes. So it slows 11 minutes in 22 hours. Therefore, let's say in one hour, it's going to slow um, by um, half a minute. So this is our rate of slowing, half a minute per hour. So now we just need to work out how many hours are between, let's say, um, 8 on a Tuesday to half 4 on Friday. So how much time is there between 8.30 on Tuesday and 4.30 on Friday? Well, let's say we've got eight hours to make um, this up to 4.30 on Tuesday. And then we've got Tuesday, we've got Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, which is an extra three days. So we'll add three lots of 24 hours, which gives a total of 80 hours between these two times. And at a rate of um, half a minute per hour, we can see that the clock is going to slow by 40 minutes. So in total, we need to add 48 um, plus 40 will give us a rate of it's going to be 88 minutes slow, or 1 hour and 28 minutes. So let's just work backwards. We need to take away 1 hour and 20 minutes from 4.30, and that's going to be 15.02. So that's our final answer, which corresponds to an answer of A.